let me tell you about one of my favorite baritones ever, my dear Simon. He was born in London in 1959. His father and his grandfather were both professional violinists, so he studied a bit the violin when he was a child, but that was not really his jam. I get you, Simon. Been there, done that. So he joined the chorus of the St. John's College, Cambridge, which is like a very big deal. We had language classes, we had coachings in how to address kings and princes and popes, and how to behave, how not to blink in front of a camera. I would never put my child through that. In 1980, he came back to St. John's College in Cambridge to study anthropology and zoology. After he graduated, he won a competition and he entered the Royal Northern College of Music to study singing. If a young singer comes to you and says, you know, I'm thinking about singing, what do you think? I would already be thinking, forget it. If they come to you and say, I'm going to sing, I don't care what you say, and there's like a fire under their rear end and they can't put it out, then I would smile inside and go, okay, well, so let's see what you sound like. He had his professional debut in Hamburg as the Count Almaviva in Mozart's Le Nozze di Figaro. It was very frightening, but it's always frightening for a beginner, right. no matter how right. well prepared you are. When he was 30, he played for five years at the Scottish Opera, where he debuted many roles. During that period, he was also singing at the Royal Opera House in London, San Francisco, Geneva, Paris, Sydney, and in 1996, he made his debut at the Met. Since then, he's been performing on all the great stages as an opera singer, but also a very good concert singer. I personally discovered him when he was singing Valentin in Gounod's Faust. <laughs> I fell in love right there. <laughs> this aria is one of the reasons, and he is one of the reasons why my heart, my soul, is longing for me to become a baritone. My biggest regret is that I'm not a baritone. It's a Faustian pact, you know, be careful in this life what you wish for, whether it's opera singers or anything. Be careful what you wish for in case you get it, because then you have to live with the consequences. He became Sir Simon Kinbeside in 2018 in the Queen's birthday honor. I don't consider myself English, British. My whole life has been on the road. I'm, a, I'm probably a European. A Figaro, 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 Figaro,